Wind or even the much colder changes that are headed our way. Wind advisory will be going into effect later on today, so right around 9 a.m. for our surrounding locations. But here in the valley, we're still preparing for wind gusts to top 40 miles per hour. Let's go ahead and take a live look outside this morning on the west side of town as the palm trees are swaying around in the breeze. But keep in mind, this is just the beginning of even bigger changes that will be marching in across our valley, not only throughout the day today, but even over the next few days. Let's go ahead and take a look at our satellite and radar this morning morning. We have very cold air dropping down out of Canada that's going to be moving. It's already moving across the northern half of our state, bringing in some snowfall and it's going to be arriving right here in the Vegas Valley over the next couple of days. Live look outside. You can see we have plenty of high clouds in the mix. We're currently at 58 degrees with wind gusts approaching 30 miles per hour. Very windy start to the day. So you're going to be reaching for that sweater jacket as you head out the door as temperatures are currently at 53 in Summerlin, 58 in Ellis Air Force space 55 in Boulder City and 55 in Seven Hills. We're preparing for a daytime high of 66 degrees. It will be windy and dusty with wind gusts 30 to 40. Mesquite today 63, Kingman at 58 with Laughlin at 72 and Mount Charleston at 38 degrees. Satellite and radar starting to see a lot of the activity heading east. Had some showers move across Mesquite and of course the northern half of our state already being impacted by plenty of snowfall moving across the Reno area. And we're going to increase the potential for seeing that winter weather right here at home as a winter storm watch goes into effect tomorrow morning. For all the locations shaded in blue here on your screen, heavy snowfall possible above 3,000 feet. We're talking accumulations of 1 to 7 inches. So here comes the system bringing us the potential for some scattered showers. We're mainly surrounded by the rain, so a little bit of light drizzle possible today. But it's really Tuesday evening overnight into Wednesday that things start to get a little more interesting. We have the snow falling across our local mountains and then it starts to move in first spreading across the Red Rock Canyon area very early Wednesday, bringing us the potential for a few flurries early Wednesday morning and then as quickly as that activity moves in, it'll be moving right on out of here. But temperatures are dropping. Look at this 66 to 57 to 51. Finally, we'll be back in the low 60s throughout the weekend. That is a look at our forecast. Don't go anywhere. More